And you're not bad most TV. Entertainment without power. the new name our federal government has given us, UAR? The problem of this country is not the name. For me, I think we have a lot of issues that we should face and not about name. I don't know. But if they can think about as and sort the issues we have, insecurity issues, poverty, and a lot of them, it's better. It's not about the name. The name, the name will not change anything. So I think our government is not putting effort on the right things. They're just, I don't know, the way they treat ourselves is not even right. So they should look into that and leave the name. Me, I don't have problem. I don't. Whichever name they want to give this country, it's their business. But do you like the name? Do you like it? The name is not bad. Do you know the full if meaning? The name, to, if the name is going to bring change, the change they promise us, fine. I don't have a problem with the name. But do you know the full meaning? Do United African Republic or something, yeah. But that's not the problem. If that name is going to bring us what we want, yeah, we citizens are okay. Which way? We'll go for it. That's All right. Thank you for talking to me. Okay. Make sure you have fun. Yeah, sure. Good evening. Good evening. You look nice. What's up with the outfit? What happened? Um, the dress code is like white African, so we have to start representing uh, where we're from. You give me your tailor's number where you're going, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> so, federal government has changed the name of Nigeria to UAR. Okay. What do you think about that? It just doesn't make sense. It means as a people, um, we are majoring on the minor and minoring on the major. Our government has went into the 21st century for crying out loud. Yeah, so it means that everything that's happening in the country, the government is insensitive about it. The government is not paying attention. They should put their attention where it's supposed to be and take their attention off where it is now. Why do you think that maybe the changing of name can make the country a better one? Why do we think changing of name changes anything? Why do we think we have to keep changing name? It doesn't mean anything. When we don't understand the history of something, and we alternate the name. It doesn't change anything. The history is still there. We as a people, we are not settled. We have to come together as one. We need to understand these differences. The man from the north, the man all the way from the east, the mountain side, the desert side, the water side have to come together for one nation. And we have to start building that thing now for our for our generation and for our kids to come. You know the women of the year? United African Republic. Hey, you got it right. Thank you for talking to me. 
Thank you very much. My wonderful people, my name is Emiola Badmos. And of course, I'm using this medium to remind you guys to please subscribe to Emiola Badmos TV on YouTube so you can get to what different trending news, you can get to what different entertainment updates, and of course, all the news going all around the world. Guys, do not forget to turn on your notification so you can get to watch all of our content. Thank you so much, guys. And Good evening. Hi, how you doing? Fine, you look nice. You look stunning. Your hair, I think you are carrying the same hair, signature. I was trying to give that uh, Marilyn Monroe vibe. I hope I tried. You tried, you killed it. Thank you. So you're here for the premiere, right? Yes, I am, I am. No. Federal government just changed um, the country's name to UAR. What do you think about that? <laughs> See, Nigeria is just on a cruise level, but honestly, things are not the way they should be. Changing the name is not even an issue right now. It is the fundamental issues that we have on ground. Health sector is terrible, education is terrible. Don't even let me get started on insecurity right now. It is so crazy and now, don't even let me start talking about the communication issue. We are being gagged in our own country, you know. So it's not about name change, it's just about getting it right. And if you talk too much now, hate speech, my sister. Let me just keep quiet at this point. So you don't think that if you ch they change the name, it's gonna make the country get better? You don't think? Nah, nah. It's, it's, okay, so is Nigeria now, do we have an alter ego? It's not like I'm trying to change my name and I want to use an affidavit to change my name. It's, it's a whole ball, it's a different ball game entirely. So it's not about name change, it's about getting it right. We have a long way to go. So it's not about name change for me. The name sounds really cool, but no. You know the full meaning of the name? Yeah, United, um, I don't know. Doesn't even make sense. But uh, I, I, I think it's, it's more than changing the name. It has a lot to do with getting the infrastructure right, getting, getting people free from this slavery. Because honestly, yeah, we have been stifled in our own country. It's crazy. Thank you for talking to me. I enjoy talking to you. Good evening. Good evening. Are you here for the premiere? Yeah. And see, you look all black, James Bond. <laughs> yeah, we come all black, James Bond, yeah. What do you think about the new name they gave Nigeria, UAR? Ah, the new name, UAR. I think that's the new name we need here in Nigeria. I think it will restructure our life, restructure our constitution. Yeah, and I think everything will go better, like expected. That's the, that's the best thing for India. You believe the name will change Nigeria? Yeah, definitely. It's going to change Nigeria, absolutely. What's the full meaning? What's the full meaning? You are. That's U E L. U E L. All right. Thank you for talking to me. Thank you too. Welcome for having me. Hello. Good evening. Hi. Good evening. You look nice. Thank you very much. I like your makeup. Done by me. So now they just gave Nigeria a new name. U E R. What do you think about the new name? U okay. Federal government just gave Nigeria a new name. U E R. What do you think about the name? I think it's ridiculous. Why? Because changing Nigerians' name or changing the country's name is not our top priority. So yeah. Do you think maybe if they change the name, the country's going to get better? Do you feel that way? Do you think if they change the name, the country's going to get better? I'm asking you. I'm asking you too. But do you know the full meaning? You are. You know the... uh, I think United Africa Republic. Something like something like that. I don't know. I'm not so sure. All right, thank you for talking to me. Thank you very much, thank you. Good evening, how are you doing? Yeah, I'm good. Are you here for the premiere? Yeah, I came for the premiere. Okay, so let me ask you now. Federal government has given Nigeria a new name, a UAR. What do you think about the name? No, I don't think it's actually okay. For me, it's not okay. Because why? I don't know why they will just decide to give a country. Yeah, we have been successful and all these years. What's their reason of giving the name UAR? Maybe if they give the name UAR, Nigeria will change. Nigeria will change to be a good country. I don't think so. Because the country right now, where it is, okay, look at look at look at the situation we are facing now. Right now, Twitter, they said, yeah, for now, they are banning Twitter. So how do you expect a country that okay, because they know that yeah, the bad things that are happening in the country, bandits and everything happening, the kidnapping and everything. So why would they decide to change the name? If you change the name and you think things will change, 
It's from the government. They have to change the, the, the leaders. I mean, we need young people in there. We don't need old people there. That's just the truth. So it's not about changing the name. It's about working on the leadership. Do you get me? So that's just it. They will like the name too. Do you know the full meaning? Serious? What? Do you know the full meaning of the name? What? Do you know the full meaning of the name? You are. I, I don't even know it. I don't want to find out because it's not. I don't think it's possible. Do you get me? I don't think it's possible because. Come on. All right. Thank you for talking to me. You're welcome. Hi, good evening. You're here for the premiere, right? Yeah, I am. You look absolutely nice, all black, as in I love your outfit. Thank you so much. So now, Project Government has changed the name of Nigeria to UAR. What do you think about that? I think I think it's a fantastic name now, United African Republic, yeah? yeah. I think um, because they don't have the capability to do anything for the country that the country needs, then they decided to change the name. Same way they changed the name of Nepal without actually changing anything that it does. Do you think the change of name will better Nigeria? Do you think it will better the country? Well, has changing Nepal's name changed, made it better? So, they are just incapable old men. Thank you for talking to me. Two years at the premiere of My Village People. We are here doing our box pop and I have this pretty lady here with me. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. I like the way you are sipping the ice cream. You want to school. Don't tell me. The federal government just changed Nigeria's name to UAR. What do you think about it? Well, I don't think they changed because I've not seen it in the news. I just saw it on the internet. So, But there's a probability. Do you like the name? Do you think it's fair? UAR sounds too though, know, but I believe in one Nigeria. I still believe in one Nigeria. I don't wish. I still believe in one Nigeria, so I don't wish we change it. So. You think the name can better Nigeria? You think the name, the changing of name, can change things in Nigeria? It's not about changing of name. It's about solving the problem. What is actually happening in the economy? So, in the country rather. So, it's not about changing of name. I can change my name, and I'm still my bad person. It's not about that way. But I don't, I don't see Nigeria being a bad country. It's just for us to, for our leaders to just be open and lead us well. Do you know the full meaning of the UAR? I don't know, but I think what I saw is United African Republic or something. I don't know. Is that right? Is, am I correct? All right. Thank you for talking to me. Welcome. Thank you. Good evening. You look absolutely nice. Ah, good evening. Can I follow you? <laughs> if you wish to. All right. Thank you. Now, the federal government has given Nigeria a new name, the UAR. What do you think about the name? Oh, well, it doesn't change the behavior of the people. Well, that's the funny thing. We are still going into the new country with the same people, same character, same banditry, so it doesn't change anything. So you don't buy the name, you don't? It doesn't, it doesn't really, there's nothing sensible about it. Do you know the full meaning? Huh? Do you know the full meaning of the UAR? United African Republic. Talk for yourself. All right, thank you for talking to me. All right, thank you very much. Good evening. Good evening. I like your skin. Simple. <laughs> Thank you. So, federal government just changed um, Nigeria's name to UAR. What do you think about it? UAR. Well, they already said they're banning Twitter in Nigeria. I think UAR will be better. <laughs> just for us to all migrate to UAR. You think the name can change things in Nigeria? Do you think the name will make Nigeria better? 
you think, the, you think the name is going to change Nigeria for good? No way. It's not going to change Nigeria. What will change Nigeria is our mentality and the way the government rules us. That's just what will change Nigeria. The name has nothing to do with it. Not the full meaning. United Africa Republic. Clap for yourself. <laughs> All right. Thank you for talking to me. Thank you. Thank you. to Eniola Bibles TV on YouTube so you can get to what different trending news you can get to what different entertainment updates and of course all the news going all around the world guys do not forget to turn on your notification so you can get to watch all of our content thank you so much guys and Eniola Bibles TV entertainment without bounds